help. They will always hate to see the resurrection of something that was dead. They will always hate to see the miracle of someone getting better, of someone progressing forward, because they're stuck in their own minds. They've allowed Satan to consume their minds. They've allowed Satan to consume their hearts. And just like Pharaoh, whenever God was doing all these miracles, Pharaoh did not want to see God's children get better. He wanted to keep them enslaved. He wanted to keep them bound. He didn't want them to progress. But the more and more that God put Moses in his path and told him to let my people go, in that instance, Pharaoh eventually broke. Even though his heart got hardened each time that he said no, he eventually broke and let them go. But the instance that he let them go and they got freedom, he chased after them. That is the, that, that is the best analogy I could use.